Hi, welcome to Free Accounting Software. My name is Glenn Hasselman. In this video, I'm going to show you how to reconcile multiple bank accounts. Um, there's different ways to do that, and in this video, I'm just going to show you how to use a regular account as the additional bank account. So, the first thing you'll have to do is set up an account for the additional bank account. And it's just a normal account. Um, I think this method is most appropriate when the um, the reason for the additional account is to use it as a um, an investment account. So I'm going to call this high interest investment account, and it's an asset. Okay. So how to use this is let's go back to the um, thing and on the cash worksheet. This cash worksheet would be for your main operating account, and the um, um, it's got an opening balance in there of ten thousand dollars at the moment. So now let's say we want to transfer some money from the main bank account into the investment account. So basically what we're doing is a cash payment because it's uh, entered from the perspective of the main bank account and um, we're paying the money out of the main bank account. So we'll call this transfer to uh, investment account. And um, let's say we're putting in $5,000 and we just simply select this uh, account that we've just set up. Okay, so basically uh, we've got our opening balance 10000 and we can see there's a transaction there that um, takes the 5000 out of the main bank account. If we go to the balance sheet, can see a uh, high interest investment account with a balance of 5000 and we click on it we can see the actual transaction which is just to transfer this uh, amount in there so now let's say um, you know you you want to transfer money back from the high interest account to the main bank account so um, we simply enter cash received transfer from investment account and let's say it's two, $2,000 and again we select that account as the account code okay so you can see the uh, money coming back into the main bank account here on the balance sheet if you click on high interest investment account you can see both transactions the five thousand dollars coming in and the two thousand um, dollars going out okay so not every transaction will be between this account and the uh, main um, bank account so um, for example interest um, that's earned on this account so I'll show you how to enter that Back on the um, organization menu, there is an option for general journals. So click on that. Now, let's say I'm going to enter some interest received. The type is a general journal. Um, interest on investment account. All right. Let's say, let's say we get about ten dollars interest. Um, with the general journal, positive numbers are debits. So a um, little bit of a disadvantage of this method is that you have to use a general journal and and understand a little bit about um, debits and credits. So we're going to um, put this positive figure of ten dollars to the account high interest investment account and that's going to increase the balance so we received interest so it's going to increase the balance okay um, general journal has to balance to zero so um, the next line is going to be a minus ten dollars and a negative figure on a general journal is a credit um, now the credit is going to go to interest received and then save journal okay so if we go back to the balance sheet we'll see that 
the um, investment account is now showing an extra ten dollars which is this interest received that we just entered okay so the next thing you'll want to do with a um, with this account because it is a bank account is reconcile it so um, the way to do that it's pretty similar to the cash worksheet you simply select all the transactions um, you'll want to check that that balance is actually the balance on the bank statement otherwise um, post some corrections now there's a note here that says if reconciling to a statement which we are um, then enter the description here so let's say bank statement balance as at 31 January and choose the date that's applicable okay once you've done that you can click this post reconciliation button and you'll see that pretty much exactly the same as the cash worksheet um, it uh, hides those uh, previous transactions and actually um, um, displays this one line that just says bank statement balance now of course you can see the history of the transactions by using these links here um, and it'll, it'll show you the history of what's in and out and what you've reconciled it against and then um, uh, no history. You can also extract this report at any particular time um, to see you know what the balance was at that time. Okay so any account on the balance sheet in free accounting software can be reconciled and um, you know most of them probably should be but in particular these kind of bank accounts um, should be reconciled. Okay so um, that's about all there is to um, using a regular account as a bank account in free accounting software. I hope this has been useful and thanks for watching.